Hello. What's your name? My name is Holly. Tell me about your look today. I love horror movies, everything spooky, gothic, dark. So I usually keep that on the inside, but I'm letting it out today. Oh, I love that. Okay. And what are you going to be doing today? I'm going to be singing. Singing. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. I was not expecting her to have a voice like that. I did not expect you to sound the way that you sound based on the cover of your book. I mean, how we <laughs> both like, what? <laughs> the stage is about expecting the unexpected. Yeah. I love that. And I think we got the real you, which is, I think, why it resonated with people here and at home for sure. Thank you. Great job. You were just so pure, and that was absolute perfection. Thank you. Well, Howie, you want to start off the voting? Yes. It's a yes from me. It's a yes from me. Four yeses for you, my love. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank you. I'm scared. I love Batman. He's impressive in real life, isn't he? What's your name? Where are you from? What's your name? It's Batman. <laughs> not sure we're going to get much out of it. I don't think so, Amanda. <laughs> well, we're not sure what you're going to do, but we wish you the best of luck. Go for it. Something has changed within me Something is not the same And through it played by the rules of someone else's game Too late for second guessing Too late to go back to sleep It's time to trust my instincts Close my eyes and leave. It's time to try to find gravity. I think I'll try to find gravity, and you can pull me down. So if you can find me, look to the western sky. Take a message back from me. Tell them how I'm behind gravity. I'm flying high, only high in gravity. And so much that is me now. And nobody in all of us, no wizard that there is of us, is ever gonna break.
up to at night, is it? You don't have to be afraid of what you are. I looked at Simon, I said, look at us all sat back taking this completely seriously. Batman singing what? bloody opera. <laughs> Did you bring Robin? Go on, out you get. Go on. Go on, Robin, out you get. Amazing, Bruno. Oh, your baritone was just brilliant. I love this show for this reason. It is an incredible adventure, and you took us there. Let's vote. Bruno. Yes. I'm saying yes. It all to my own. They do, darling. I love it. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, God! 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 Expecting that. No. <laughs> May I suggest Alka Seltzer, darling? Because that will settle it a little bit. <laughs> Did you really fly in from America to birth with me? Yes, Simon. Really, it was so stupid, it was brilliant. <laughs> really? And that's a compliment. <laughs> Scale. And where do you see this going if if you were to go through? No, no, she can't go any further. <laughs> well, look, um, there's not much to say. Bruno, yes or no? He's a no, my love. Alicia. Um, it's a no for me. <laughs> oh, oh, Amanda, please. It's it's. <laughs> oh, no. I'm out of here. I'm out of oh, here. No, Amanda. It takes a lot of. I am bitterly disappointed. <laughs> oh, no, no! I love it, girl. Oh. You don't want to reconsider it. Oh, no. Sign burping too. Oh, no, let's go. Oh, they've gone. Two of them have gone. I'm going to say yes. I think this audience loved you. Yes, they do. I'm giving you a yes. <laughs> Bruno. Come on, Bruno. <laughs> I can't possibly imagine how you're going to outgross this grossness. I'll change it around. <laughs> you got three yeses. That took us by surprise a little bit. I'm so sorry I embarrassed you. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. How are you? 
Good, lovely to meet you. What's your name? My name is Innocent Masugu. Can I just say, you look amazing. Thank you. Thank well, you. I love that top. Yeah. I love it. So this was actually made by my mum, yeah. Aww. That's so cute. It looks really nice on you. We're <laughs> <laughs> moving to fashion. OK. <laughs> it's all right. Great. OK, well, look, tell me about you. I'm Innocent Masugo from South Africa, but I live in London. OK, now, do you think you're going to win? Yes. <laughs> OK. Well, I think we, let's find out. <laughs> you ready? Yes. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> E tira fuori il vento. That's special, isn't it? Ma c'è poco di suriento. Un uomo in braccio, una ragazza, dopo che aveva pianto. Poi si schierisce la voce e ricomincia il canto. Overwhelming, yes. actually. Yep. By the end of that song, I felt like I was just hit in the chest yep. with this force, like it felt divine almost. Yeah. This is your calling. Oh, I couldn't agree more. It was very, very special. You are special. Diamond says it every year. You've got to keep raising the bar when we're looking for talent. You we have can't. to look back, we have to have people who go beyond our expectations, and that's exactly what you did today. Hands down, in the 17 years that we've been doing Britain's Got Talent, you are by far the best opera singer we have ever had. Oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> 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 
Michelle. I think it was because your mum made your top. Yes, yeah. yes, it's the energy problem. <laughs> I'm really curious, have you had people who've said you're not very good? The worst thing was uh, you won't get really far with opera, so stop. I hope this idiot is watching this right now. Me too. <laughs> because that was wonderful. I mean, seriously, wonderful. So heartfelt and so powerful. You deserve this break. You really, really do. I have a feeling I know which way this is going. Bruno. Yes. Alicia. It's a yes from me. Amanda. It's a yes from me. What do you think? Yeah. That's about 4,000 yeses. Oh. Yeah. Goodness. You're amazing! Oh, what a great audition. That was unbelievable. It was. This year it's all about real people, it feels like. Yeah, you're right. Welcome. Hello. Hello, who are you? I am Rebecca Strong. Rebecca, where are you from? I'm from Prince Albert, Saskatchewan. I'm Dene Suslene, so I'm First Nation. And what do you do? I sing. How did you get into music? My dad was a musician, and he started a band with me and my sisters when I was younger, and I continued. Does this mean a lot to your family as well, then? Yes, of course. They're actually in the crowd right now. Are, they? <laughs> Are you nervous? I'm, I'm nervous. There was a saying, if you're not nervous, then you're not passionate about it, so. <laughs> well, the stage is yours. Good luck. Thank you. Stone cold, stone cold. You see me standing, but I'm dying on the floor. Stone cold, stone cold. Maybe if I don't cry, I won't feel it. Happy feel Know that I am Even if I Can't understand If happy talk, I'm happy feel Don't want to be stone cold
What are you thinking? Um, I'm just very, very happy that I could touch so many people's hearts tonight. This stage has brought me a lot of confidence and just showing who I am. You know what? You have such a beauty. You really do. And uh, a sweetness. And I think you're not only making Canada proud, but you make your indigenous culture very proud. That was an amazing moment, young lady. <laughs> well, thank you so much. <laughs> the prize for Canada's Got Talent is $1 million this season. Every golden buzzer is $25,000. How would that change your life? Money doesn't buy happiness, of course, but it would change our life. Um, my parents, my dad especially, he's old, so I would, <laughs> I would love for him to retire. <laughs> Daddy, stand up! You know, I am a believer that every person on this planet has a purpose. You're here on this stage, proving to yourself you're a singer, showing exactly who you are. Right now, this moment, this is your purpose. And you know what my purpose is? Sharpest words wanna cut me down. My purpose is to help people like you. This is brave, this is bruised, this is who I'm meant to be. This is me. Welcome to Britain's Got Talent. Thank you. What's your name? It's Emma Haslam. Can I ask your age, Emma? I'm 27. OK. And where are you from? I'm from Derby. Are you married? Yeah, I'm married and I've got a three-year-old daughter. And I see a pole. I see a skimpy outfit. I'm trying to promote pole fitness is not for the usual sizes. I'm, obviously, I'm a bigger lady. <laughs> and I'm just hoping that people will just see that I'm good at what I do. All right, Emma, best of luck. Good body confidence is a massive example to girls all over the world. Don't care what size you are, you're brilliant at what you do. I'm going to kick this off with a yes. It's a yes from me. It's a yes from me. Four yeses. Hello. 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 Okay, everyone, this is Ank Erdin from Mongolia, and yes. he has won Mongolia's Got Talent. Tiyak mini murut man dochi matrose, ne tiyak matrose bi ek ayvesta mongkuchut. Ayvesta mongkuchut. 
Heidi, your turn. Come to mommy. Uh oh. Oh, oh don't, Whoa. Heidi. He is good. Did you want this one? Yes, Simon? I did. He's amazing. Mongolia's Ooh. got talent. The winner. How are you? I chose you because your voice is amazing. And because also you're a winner. And I like winning also. <laughs> <laughs> are you a little bit nervous? Yeah. yeah. So I think it's important to project because you have a star voice. I'm a ditch test and the park. I'm running in bed, let's check Tom Bettler or something. Many a hammy to Tom would have lost his team, Jenny, a hot other. In those many bottoms, a shooting man was just Jenna. Did you mentor in Mongolian? I've been to Mongolia. I went That's to the. That's not what I asked. I uh, no, I didn't. Okay, here we go. Ten seconds. Six, five seconds. And I got friends in low places where the whiskey drowns in the beer. Jesus, my blues away. Is that coming out of him? And I'll be okay. I was not expecting that from Mongolia. <laughs> Blaming all my roots, I sure them boots. Ruined your bike tower for you. Last one new. You last one to show I was the last one you thought you see there. And I saw the surprise, I fear in his eyes. And I took his glass of champagne. And I do said you say, don't even maybe hurl. But you never hear me complain. <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> Was he lip syncing? No, of course not. No, no one can lip sync on American. Were you lip syncing? No. Don't judge a book by its cover, Howie Mandel. Yeah. How would you even know this kind of music? How did you get into this kind of uh, music? It's called the internet. <laughs> you don't find this amazing? Yes. Of course. That's why but he is I, on my I'm dream not, team. I'm not surprised. This is exactly what this young man should be singing. Yee because to your that. tone is stunning. Absolutely yeah. stunning. I love this performance. Yes, love. Thank you. What I would like to have seen is for the music just to stop and for you to do like an a cappella. Because I need to uh, hear this guy no, sing. No, no. Do you know next what? Round, Can I say something? Round. Maybe next time next you round. start a cappella. That was uh, my idea, Simon. Not now it isn't. I think, and I then think, I think. The track comes. You know what? Doesn't matter, it was brilliant. Thank you so much, you were amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, who are you? Hi, I am Ziggy. I'm 22 years old and I'm from the Netherlands. The wow. Netherlands? Wow, you are a long way from home. What do you do in the Netherlands? I've done a lot of TV shows over there, The Dutch Idol. So are you like a big personality in the Netherlands? I am, but not the most likable person. Same. Yeah, so in the Netherlands, people call me a cotton candy who can't do anything. What? Oh, no, come on. A cotton candy? Yep. 
I take that as a compliment. I, I was going to say too, that. Come like, on, it seems like you're just having fun. Yes, yeah. I do. I really enjoy every second of life, you know, and I love to make art and I love to inspire people. And that's why I'm here. All right, Ziggy, you ready? Yes, I am. Let's do it, Ziggy. Do it. Yes. <clears throat> Giving me a million reasons to let you go. You're giving me a million reasons to quit the show. Cause you're giving me a million reasons. Give me a million reasons. Oh, and I bow down to pray. I try to make the worst seem better. Lord, show me. To cut through all these for of leather I've got a hundred million reasons to walk away But maybe I just need one good one to stay Wow, that's nice If you say something that you might even mean It's hard to even fathom Which part is you believe you give Maybe I just need one good one to stay. <sighs> oh my God, it was so scary. <laughs> okay, so look, there's people that say all kinds of stuff about you online. And maybe some of those comments have affected you. So I think there's something inside of you that's saying, I just need like a little shot to show my true self. I do. You just need to be singing from your heart. Did you sing for your mom or your dad? No, not that much. My mom was a drug addict, so I didn't see her. Yeah. And your dad? It was a complicated relationship. He passed away last year, but uh, we were good sometimes. We were. Well, yeah. we're, who raised you? I raised myself. There you go. <laughs> You have been trying to get people to like you and accept you your whole life. God gave you a gift. Amen. I want America and especially the people back in the Netherlands to finally know who you are. Thank you. <laughs> I, I love this show because when I started this show, I, I didn't realize how much I would grow as a person. That's true. And seven years ago, my first thought would have been, who is that crazy person? Right. Now my brain is like, well, that's going to be a fun audition. <laughs> well, here you walk in and you deliver oh. one of the best performances of the day. Oh and my God. <laughs> thank you for just coming in and being a great singer. Thank you. I think that's what Idol does best, is it tells so many stories and we feel connected. You raised you. Now we are going to raise you up. It's a yes for me. Thank you. Katie? It's a yes for me. It's a yes for me. Yes. <laughs> three for three. Oh my god. <laughs> competing on American Idol. Yes! <laughs> I'm ready. Hello. Oh. Hello. Oh, there's a lot of people here. My God, I think I'll go home. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Canada's Got Talent. I have no idea. I just uh, I, uh, what brought me here. I've, I've got a man. What question are you answering? 
I'm sorry? <laughs> He's I, on I mean, you're death, you're but... answering questions no one has asked you, sir. <laughs> what is your name? Mark Lewis is my name. What are you going to do for us tonight? I'm going to do some card tricks. How old are you? I'm 79 years old. Well, you... Wow. <laughs> are you having a good day? Pardon? Are you having a good day? Not really, no, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Do you think that what you have for us today is worthy of a million dollars? What am I going to do with a million dollars at my age? I'll be dead. I'll be dead. <laughs> How bloody good is that? <laughs> God almighty. <laughs> if you win this... If I win a million dollars... And if you get a golden buzzer, $25,000 from oh, CIBC. Oh, I don't mind that. I'll take the 25 grand right now. <laughs> but you want to win the contest, right? No, pretty, I don't get... I, there's more chance of being struck by lightning than that happening. <laughs> I don't have it. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. They told hey, wait, me wait, they, can I help you on that? Do you, know, why? No, you have people doing things on trapezes and uh, going on fire and everything, and they're worried about me coming down a few bloody stairs. <laughs> oh, uh, well, that's one, an act. One, one two, two, three, three four, yeah. four, two more, five, hold on. Six, seven. Yay! Amazing. Yay! Yay! All right. Don't get too excited. You haven't seen the card trick yet. <laughs> <laughs> Gentlemen there, uh, have you ever met me before? No. You seem happy about that. <laughs> when, when, I, when I snap my fingers, I'd like you to think of any card in the pack now. Do you have a card in your mind? Yes. Don't tell me. OK. Got one in your mind? Yes. I have a card here in my hand. Out loud, what card are you thinking of? Ace of spades. The ace, ace of no way! spades. Ace of spades. No way! Uh, <laughs> Done. That shot you all up for a minute, didn't it? All right, let's try this now. Uh, would you help me, my dear? Yes. Uh, would you take any card you like, but remember you have a free choice. Take any one you like. I Go love on. this guy. Show it to them. Don't let me see it. You can show it to the audience. Show it to the show audience. It. I'll take my glasses off so I can't see it by accident, OK? All right, put the card back in the pack anywhere you want. Now, the idea of the trick is, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to make your card come to the top of the pack, OK? OK. May I know your name? L Lily. Lily. Um, <laughs> This card here should be your card. It might not be, I don't know, but we'll see. We all make mistakes. My mother made one. Well, let's try it. <laughs> <Tell me. laughs> Was that your card? No. It wasn't? Oh, no. Bloody, bloody hell. All right. Take the eight with your thumb on top. Thumb on top. Yep, that's your thumb. Push it in the middle anywhere you like. Hold on to the eight very tightly. Yeah. The card above the eight should be your card. Was it this one? No. What was the name of your card? Uh, Six of Diamonds. Six of Diamonds. Yeah. Turn that one over. What? <laughs> what? Wow! What? Wow! I'm going to run the cars from one hand to the other like that. I'd like all four of you to call out stop anytime you like. We'll use the card you stopped me. Are you ready? Yep. Say stop quickly. Stop! Too slow, you've got to be quick. Say stop quickly. Stop! Too slow, you've got to be quick. Say stop quickly. Stop! I haven't started yet. <laughs> Look. I will slow down, you speed up, we'll meet in the middle, all right? That's the best way to do it. All right, say stop any time you like. Stop. Have a look at that card. Show it to them, don't let me see it. Okay, everybody know the card. Um, put, put the card back somewhere. There, that's very good. Will you give me five guesses? Five chances to find your card. Say yes. Yes. Good. <laughs> so if, if you say no, it's not much of a trick. This might be your card. It might be this one. Okay. It might be, oh, I don't bloody know. Oh, that one there. Two more guesses. Uh, look, it might be that one. It might be this one. Okay. No, I don't know. I think, I hope, I pray that one of these five cards is the chosen card. Tell me, was that the card? No. Oh, it doesn't matter. I've still got four cards yeah. left. So it's probably one of these four. Was this the card? No. Mm -mm. Third time's a charm, although I'm not that charming. Is your card, was it there? It is not. No. Mm -hmm. Is it either of those two cards? No. No. Well, just touch one of the five cards now. Touch one, quick. Keep your finger on it. I could not possibly have known beforehand which of the five you touch. Is that correct? Correct. Tell me the name of your card. Ace of uh, Spades. Oh, that's all the same one you thought of, the Ace of Spades again. Coincidence. Well. All right. Well, turn that one over slowly. What have you got? Show it to the... There we are, ladies, the Ace of Spades. Thank what? you very much, everybody. What? Wow. What? Good luck. Wow. Good luck. Yes. Bye-bye. Thank you very much. Watch Here you go.
Wait, 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 wait. Watch behind you. Oh, yeah, Watch yeah. behind you. I'll do this. Okay. There Thanks we go. Lot. There we go. Okay. You good on this? Thank you, Harry. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you. Cheerio. Wow. I'll start. I'll start. I just think that you are not only magical, you are such a great, lovable character. For a guy that comes out and doesn't even know where he is, <laughs> you are the sharpest person I have met so far this season. You're born to do magic and comedy. Thank you for coming. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Chris. Yeah, an absolute delight. I would like to take you home with me. Just oh, that's very <laughs> nice. <laughs> that's fun. The offers I get coming here. I was literally flabbergasted. That magic was so good, and I just loved your personality. And this is the type of talent that could possibly win much. a million yeah. dollars. Okay. Okay. Am I supposed to go now? No, 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 we gotta no, vote. no. Here's how it goes. I'm gonna give you a yes. Thank you. You're welcome, Lily. I'm also gonna give you a yes. That's two yeses. Trish. I'm gonna give you your third yes. Party. <laughs> Party. And this is only for reference. I'm Cardinal giving you a yes. -er. Yeah. Four yeses. Four yes. Okay. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. bye, -bye. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, it's this way, is it? Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> Howie's requesting a producer to the judge's desk, please. Thank you, Mark. Thank you, Mark. He just sent that. Uh... Howie needs us to hold the set. So I'm going to have to be stuck in a holding. Something's happening here. Stand by. I'm just thinking, we just let it do. Like everybody, young and old, we're laughing. I'm down. I'm down. Okay. I'm Lindsay? Yeah. Are you, are you still back there with uh, our buddy? I am, yeah. Can we talk to Mark for one more second? But here we go, you can just go right on stage there, yeah. Mark Lewis! I wanna ask you something. I've just been apprised of some stuff. You emailed our producers, didn't you? I did, yeah. And I'll just read a line. It says, uh, uh -oh. am I gonna have to be stuck in a holding room for hours with hundreds of eager contestants? I would regard this possibility with abject horror and you wouldn't see me near the place. Like, you're not happy to be here. I'm happy now. <laughs> <laughs> Do you love this guy? Okay. Lindsay, come here. Lindsay, come here for a minute. You want to give him $25,000? Well, Mark, as a group, let's put our hands together. Here's $25,000! Even that. Nearly had a heart attack there. $25,000, You understand what just happened? You understand what just happened? Mark Lewis! You are the group golden buzzer, which means you are going straight through to the next round. And you have just won $25,000. So this is the lovely Skylar Blue. And I got to go and meet her at her dance class. And I got to surprise her and tell her that she could come and audition on the show this year. Oh my God. How old are you, Skylar? Seven. Wow. Oh. So who have you brought with you today, Skylar? My mum. Hi, Mum. So you feeling excited? Yeah. Yeah, and you're going to have fun, aren't you? Yeah. Right, well, we're all behind you, and we wish you the best of luck. So go for it, darling. Good luck. Thank Good you. Good luck, honey. Have fun. Oh, I'm just nervous at this bee. You walked with me, footprints in the sand, and help me understand where I'm going. You walked with me. When I was all alone 
with so much unknown along the way. And then I heard you say, I promise you. incredible you have so much talent the whole routine was just immaculate absolutely loved it you were so graceful and so expressive I mean I'm just bursting so goodness knows how your mum feels backstage you did an amazing job good one too. hey how good was that <laughs> You're this good at seven, my goodness me. Please don't forget us when you're world famous, <laughs> okay? It's such a big deal, isn't it? At seven years old, performing on this huge stage in front of all of these people. I can't imagine how you're feeling, but you did so well. You're so talented, and I just can't wait to see what happens with you in your future. So I'm really happy for you, Skylar. Well done, darling. <laughs> So I'm saying yes. Skyler, of course. Yes! Amanda? It's a yes from me. Now you've got four yeses. Oh, that's adorable, man. Have you come on to Britain's Got Talent? I want to make an announcement and, and quit my job, really. I want to be a little bit more positive and uh, hopeful for a better future. So I've come up here to spread some love and sing a song. Great. <laughs> well, look, normally, Dev, I would ask someone, you know, how many kids you have. How many demons do you have? Oh, goodness me. Countless. OK. And who would be... Would you phone one of the demons first if you got through? Ooh. Maybe a group chat. Well, we wish you all the best.
Okay. Forget them. I only just got them. Just got them. I want to break free. Well, I didn't expect that. I want to break free. I want to break free from your lies. You're so self-satisfied. I don't need you. I want to break free. And God knows. God knows I want to break free. I fall. Certainly the best singing devil we've had on today. <laughs> and you're, you're very horny as well. <laughs> Are you going back to hell now? Not without one of you lot. I had no idea the devil was so talented. Oh, stop it. <laughs> what worried me about it was you kept saying that God knows you want to break free. <laughs> well, he'd know, wouldn't he? You actually, you've got a very good voice. Thank you. I particularly loved some of your vocals. They were really cool. I don't know whether this is flattering or not, but, you know, you as the devil have every show in the world to choose to audition on, yeah. and you chose Britain's Got Talent, so <laughs> I somehow feel that's a compliment. I mean, good company. Um, this is going to be the performance I'm going to remember most. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna vote. David. Dev. Let me give you your first yes. Yay! I'm saying yes. It is a yes from me, Dev. Uh, the devil, you've got four yeses. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah, it was fun. It's yeah. real, very surreal. But, it's yeah. real for us, you know. Yeah. I expected to meet them in hell, but I'm thrilled. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you met them all, yeah. Crossed off the list. Lovely um, to meet you. You too, mate. Right. Congratulations. Well done. You. See you next time. There, out in the darkness, a fugitive running. Fallen from God in order and light You are the sentinels Silent and sure Keeping watch in the night Keeping watch in the night You know your place in the sky You hold your course and your aim 
and each in your season returns and returns and it's always the same and if you fall as Lucifer fell you fall in flame and so it must be for so it is written on the doorway to paradise those who falter and those who fall must pay the price. Lord, let me find him that I may see him safe behind bars. I will never This I swear, this I swear by the stars. If I lay here, if I just lay. Cigarette, were you? Um, Bruno, talk about going for it. I tell you, you could walk into a West End show, a Broadway show tomorrow. Very, very difficult song, sang better than most people have heard it sang. I've seen Les Mis countless times, and you just knocked it out of the park. Flawless. You are adorable. You are so sweet and you don't realise how great you are. I'm so really, much. really happy for you that you've had this moment. Thank you. Travis, I mean, it was obviously an amazing audition. I mean, literally, that's what I call selling a song. This was an audition we're going to remember, Travis. Bruno. Yes, yes! Alicia. It's a yes from me. Amanda. 100% yes from you. What do you think? That's about 4,000 yeses. My name's Kyle Tomlinson. Nice to meet you, Kyle. Nice to meet you too. Where are you from, my darling? Sheffield. Sheffield! <laughs> and how old are you? I'm 15. OK, Kyle, so tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, I'm sorry, I'm really nervous. I can tell, that's OK. Take your time. It's all right. Um, well, I came a couple of years ago and I got told to get a singing teacher and... Who told you that? David? Yeah. Me? Oh, OK. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't sound like the kind of sensible thing I'd say. <laughs> Was it said it quite harshly? Yeah. Really? <laughs> and, Kyle, how old were you when you said that to you? Twelve. Oh. Twelve? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Boo! Yeah, boo, boo, boo. Well, I'm shocked. 
So presumably for the last couple of years you've been working with a teacher yeah. and you're feeling more confident now? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Do you need a little sip of water or something before you start? David, David, David. Don't Too late for that. <laughs> <laughs> Too late. You try everything you can to be nice now. What did the you others nice say? Then. What did the others say? They were right nice. Were they? <laughs> well, I was the... I this was, is strange. I was the mean one. Yeah. I'm the only nice one here. Oh, that's a lie. By the way, we're sure. here to support you, Carl, so good luck. Here's your chance to Thank prove you. David wrong. <laughs> what did I say? Did I... Thank you. Come on, son. Can do it. <clears throat> I heard there was a secret chord. David played and it pleased the Lord But you don't really care for music, do ya? Well, it goes like this The fourth, the fifth, the minor fall And the major lift, the baffle king Compared to hallelujah Sounds great, doesn't it? There, you put your heart and soul on the line, and we all felt it, and we were all there with you. That was brilliant. You know, this just shows you, Kyle, when someone grinds you down and says, you're not good enough, you come back, and you come back and look them in the eye, and you go, I am good enough. Thank you. David, what did you think? I thought it was really good. <laughs> Well done. And you know what? You've sung with real passion. And that's what it's all about. Well done. Well done. Well done. Thank you so much. Thank you. You gave every single ounce you could possibly give to that performance. Well done. Well done. Kyle, it was a really, really moving performance, and I'm really glad you came back and proved me wrong. Thank you. <laughs> You like that? I really loved that. I really loved it. We will see you live in the studio 
Is that you, Deck? <laughs> <laughs> Please, sir, tell us your name. Uh, I'm Ned. How old are you, Ned? I'm eight. So cute. Yeah. Where are you from? Maidstone. Oh. Who's here with you today? Well, I'm with my mum, my dad, mm -hmm. my stepmum, my sister, my other sister, and my brother. Fantastic. Do you perform for friends and family? Do you get up in school and do shows? Yeah. The stage is yours, sir. Good luck. Oh, I love him already. Come on, Ned. Why were people so excited about that talking dog on Britain's Got Talent? Amanda Holden's been on it for years. It was really fun meeting Ant and Deck backstage, but I'm never quite sure which one's supposed to be the funny one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's killing us all! <laughs> Alicia? Oh, no. Yeah. Alicia laughing? Oh, no. Alicia not dancing? <laughs> <laughs> Simon. What, so he reminds me a lot of my dad. He's a cross dresser. He gets especially cross when he can't find his socks. <laughs> <laughs> I was really worried for David Williams when he swam on the River Thames for charity because of all that garbage going in his mouth. But since I've been watching BGT, I'm relieved it's all coming out again. <laughs> Well done, we have what it takes to get them through to the next round is Eugene. My name's Eugene. I'm 37. I'm a librarian. Eugene. Pleased to meet you. I've come here today to share my passion with poetry with all who want to listen. I understand that the judges aren't great fans of poetry but I feel I have the personality and the charisma to win them round. What about the girl side of things? I've always been a magnet to the ladies. Yeah, you got a girlfriend? Not yet. Right. What sort of girl would you look for? One that says yes. Nice. I'm going to go out there on that stage and I'm going to be a white knight on the stallion of poetry. Good evening. Hello, what's your name? My name's Eugene. All right, do you want to get on with it? I'm here tonight to share with you my passion. Poetry. <laughs> May I present to you my ode to Britain's Got Talent. You'll never make it through, they said. They're bound to choose another. You are a loser. Always were. So I said, thank you, mother. <laughs> but I am no contortionist. I can't juggle with a ball. I haven't got a friendly pet. I've got no friends at all. <laughs> or I could do some magic. Oh, that much is clear. For when I enter a crowded room, the girls just disappear. <laughs> It doesn't really matter, though, cos I'll try any trick just to get me on the show to tell Piers he's a... <laughs> a genius with his finger on the pulse of popular culture. <laughs> <laughs> I may go through tonight or not, of that I do not know. But at least I can say to my girls that Daddy's given it a go. Thank you very much. I'm, I'm going to hand over.
over to someone who may want to start with a little apology. Piers. <laughs> I'm sorry uh, for buzzing you, uh, because actually that was a very funny act. I thought it was very well written, and uh, you made me laugh. And it's the first time anyone like you has ever had a standing ovation, so that was pretty remarkable. Thank you very much. Piers, yes or no? Uh, I'm going to say yes, Eugene. I'm going to say yes. Eugene, you've got three yeses. Congratulations. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Yeah. I can't believe I managed to turn Piers around. I know. And he apologised. Says a lot. No one's ever apologised to me. Have they, have they had anything they've ever said? And they've said some things. Have they? For like what? Not nice things. Give me an example. I'd not like to go into it right now. OK, sorry. Do you reckon you'll get to the semi? I've already had a standing ovation from 2,000 people. I can die happy now. Nice to meet you. And you. Hello. Your name is? Um, I'm Emma Jones. How old are you? I'm 23. 23. And where are you from? I'm from Wigton in Cumbria. And why have you entered the show? I just um, want to just g give, it, give it a try and see if, if you like my voice. Are you nervous, Emma? All right, well, good luck, sweetheart. Thank you. Good, nice to meet you. Uh, what's the act called? Uh, Charlotte and Jonathan. Charlotte and Jonathan. OK. Um, uh, how old are you both? I'm 16. And I'm 17. OK. Um, and, and you thought the combination would work. Whose idea was it? Um, it was our singing teachers, actually. She thought it'd be good to try us out together. <laughs> and we both sounded quite good when we sang what we did. OK. You're not saying much, Jonathan. <laughs> are you shy? Uh, sometimes. <laughs> I've always had sort of problems with my size since like, I can remember. 
and when I was in sort of primary school, it was back then really that I had sort of the mick taken out of me and it, it kind of damaged my confidence quite a bit. When, when people would say something to me, I'd just, it'd just take a little piece out of me in a sense. I'm quite protective of Jonathan, like if someone, if I was there and someone stood there and said something to him, I wouldn't sit, I couldn't sit there with my mouth shut. Before you make a judgment on someone, I think you really need to get to know them. It's not, it's cliche as it's not judging a book by its cover. You've got, you've got to read what's inside. Charlotte's been a really big help for me in terms of confidence and making me a better performer. And I really don't think I'd be going up on stage today if I didn't have Charlotte by my side. And do you think you could win? Yeah, together. All right, good luck. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Here we go. that you can move an audience like that. You sing beautifully together. It was world class. Thank you very much, thank you. A pop voice and an opera voice together. It was incredible. Okay, this is what I think. As Charlotte, I think you're good, but Jonathan, you are unbelievable. You have an outstandingly good voice. Thank you very much. How old are you? 17. I mean, that's unbelievable. Jonathan, you are a future star. Thank you. I like the fact that this works as a duo, but I worry, Charlotte, whether you're going to hold him back. We've come on here as a duo, and we're going to stay here as a duo. OK, David, we better vote, yes or no? Oh, 
such an easy decision, yes. Thank you. Definitely a yes from me. Charlotte, I think your voice complements Jonathan's really well, so don't be disheartened. It's a yes from me. You know, my head here would say to you, Jonathan, dump her. <laughs> and then my heart would say there was something kind of magical at moments together as well. So I'm going to say yes to the two of you. You've got four yes. Right, we're looking for the last act here from the auditions. Uh, who's it, Sue? Sue. Sue. We're looking for Sue, who was the final auditionee of 2017. Sue! 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 Last act. We need the last act on stage. Sue. Is so Sue there? Any, any acts there? No? Oh my God! Don't tell me not to fly. I've simply got to. If someone takes a spill, oh, there she is. Oh, Sue. Hi, Sue. A freckle on the nose of life's complexion, a cinder or the shiny apple of the sun. I've got a fly once, I've got a try once, only can die once, right, sir? Ooh, life is juicy, juicy, and you'll see. I gotta have my bite, I'm gonna live and live now. Get what I want, I know how. One Beat him, join him. Come on, man. What's your name? <laughs> My name's Sue Alicia. Nice Where to meet you, Sue. Where are you from? I'm from Clayton Lee Moores in near Accrington in Lancashire. You're just a good Do you have a day job? Uh, I'm a singer. <laughs> You're brilliant. Oh, thank you. thank you. I don't know what you did to us, but you made David strip. I know. Woo! You're one of those people. You made us all so happy. We all just wanted to join in like a lot of the best performers. It was a very, very fitting end to Britain's Got Talent 2017. You were fantastic. Simon. I'm traumatised. I literally can't get this thought out of my mind, what I just saw. <laughs> I'm really sorry. I'm, you know what? That was a great entrance. Uh, the fact that you carried on with all the nuttiness. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Last audition of the series, and you made it worthwhile, right? Can we take a vote, guys? I'll kick this off with a yes. Thank you. I'm saying yes. 
I'm saying yes. And I'm not saying yes to you, but I'm saying yes to you. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Oh, nice tea cup. I like tea. Okay. I love tea. I love tea. I love tea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What is your name and where have you come from? I'm Tony Kaku. Where are you from, Tony? Japan. Oh, I love Japan. Yeah, Tony Kaku, Japan. Why have you flown all the way to be on Britain's Got Talent? I want to perform to Loyang family. Woohoo! Yeah! King Charles loves me. And what you're doing for us today, is it your day job? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Uh, if you want it to be, it is. Do you want to just get on with it? OK. Yeah. My dance never seen before. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, hello! Oh, hello, Tony! Kaku! Woo! Tony's gonna take it off. I'm wearing pants. Yes! But I can pose naked. Oh, okay. Okay. No, thank you. Number one, football player naked pose. I'm wearing pants! Ah! Yeah. That's genius. Finally! Don't stop! Spice Girls! Spice Girls! Wannabe! Wannabe! Naked Pose! Okay, okay. 
Tony. You might actually be my favourite contestant of the whole series so far. Thank you. Arigato. No, arigato gozaimasu to you. Yeah, thank you. Oh my God. Come on, Tony. <laughs> Bruno, what did oh, you listen, think? Oh, listen, I have to say, you definitely have both. <laughs> Great, what can Thank I say? You. <laughs> Nanda, Tony, you are absolutely unique and it felt very Britain's Got Talent. I loved it. Thank you. Simon? Honestly, you are the funniest contestant we've had on all oh, year. Seriously. Funny boy! Really, really funny and original. Thank you. Simon Naked Paul. No, 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 no. No. Simon? No. Always keep them waiting, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to have to take a vote now, yeah. though. Oh, it's a yes from me. Yes! Amanda? It's a yes from me, Tony. Thank you! Tony Kaku. Tony Kaku. It's a yes from me! Me! Yes! Simon? Tony, honestly, you are unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> You, you are brilliant. Simon, Simon love me? I absolutely love you. Unbelievable. You have four yeses. Get a breath. Important. You're there. Y'all are there. <laughs> <laughs> there ain't no gold in this river that I've been washing my hands in forever. I know there is hope in this water. But I can't bring myself to swim when I am drowning in this island's baby. Let me go easy. Oh, hey, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> I had there you good go. intentions. It probably doesn't even show Go he's Hot me, baby I was still a child I didn't get the chance to I can't hear you Feel the world around me I had no time to choose What I chose to do so go easy on me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank yeah, you so yeah, yeah. much. Yeah. I think you may be leaning on falsetto a little much. Okay. But I really think there's a lot of interesting stuff you have going on in there. Uh, Please, can you sing the chorus now with more volume? Just the chorus. Okay. Let it go. Go easy on me, baby. I was still a child. I didn't get the chance to. Let's go for it. Feel the world around me. I had no time to choose what I chose to do. So go easy. On me, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, you you've got some yeah. some real magic sauce yeah. going in there. I think if we kind of coach you through, you got a <laughs> lot of really good things going in your favor. I think you're young. I think you're one of our best vocalists, hmm. potentially. 
it is a competition. So you definitely right. have to have that passion. Do you have that passion? I think so. <laughs> I think you've got a God-given talent. You are blessed beyond belief. Thank you. Now you just need to know how to fight. Okay. Right. You got a natural sound. It's called your sound. And boy, did I love it. Oh, th <laughs> thank you. I'll go first. Oh, oh, I, I, just, I, I, I love your voice. Big things are coming for you. It's a yes for me. Um, I think if you found your fighting spirit, if you put your passion to the test and got a little bit competitive and just yeah. really trusted your talent, you could go top 24 this year. So that's obviously a yes for me. Ooh, tell it, tell it. Yep, you're a great singer. Thank Just you. get smart with it. Yeah. I'm a yes, which means one, two, three. Yeah. You're going to Hollywood. Oh, this is weird. Hello. Welcome. Thank you. Actually reminds me of a little Britain sketch that I did. <laughs> Please, could I have your names? I'm Paddy. Yeah, I'm Nico. And um, what is the nature of your relationship? It's, it's a professional one. And m might we ask you your age? I will be 80 this July. Do you think you can win the show? Oh, it would be very nice, but just as long as people enjoy what we're doing and we give people pleasure, that's the main thing. OK, well, best of luck.
I just thought that was incredible. Well done. Absolutely incredible. Wow. Uh, well, I apologise uh, for what I did, because I did obviously buzz a little early. This is before all the crazy things happened, you know? It, it was all kind of like slow and normal, and then it all went ballistic. It was extraordinary. You're an amazing example to older people, because you've shown that However old you are, you can still be spectacular and beautiful and do something amazing. She can. All people can. If you want, you can. How did you get into dancing? I had been a dancer from the age of two and a half, like lots of little girls, and I gave it up to get married. I had four children. Then when did you pick up dancing again? I went to live in Spain with my husband, and unfortunately, after 18 months, he died. Oh, and for something to do, I went to Nico's Dance Academy to learn something totally different. And this is the result. My grandmother is 93 years old, and I just kept thinking of her when you were being thrown around her. <laughs> that man and um, I think she would have wanted me to press my buzzer for you as well so me and my nan are going to be right behind you and I hope you win Britain's Got Talent. <laughs> the fact that you did it for all those years and then and then had your lovely children then lost your husband you gave up so much. Well when I started to do this I spoke with the family and I said what do you think? And they said, well, you gave everything up to have us look after Dad, and he would be proud. Yes, he would. Paddy, you are my hero. Like, you are unbelievable. I pray to God that I am like you when I'm your age. I don't want to sound patronising, but we have to just say it as it is. That is something I've never seen before. I'm so pleased Amanda has pressed her button. And do you know what? We don't have to vote. And if you have a minute, Hello. Hello. Who are you? My name is Megan. And Cameron. And uh, we're from Prince Edward Island. Hey. Prince Edward Island! I love that. Well, now we need to know, what do you do? We do the thing everybody's hoss in this very room. <laughs> <laughs> Through <laughs> dance. <laughs> <laughs> What's your biggest dream? Of being a superhero. <laughs> you want to be a superhero? <laughs> I love that. And you want to dance. I want to dance. Are you what, nervous? What? I'm so nervous and so scared. <laughs> uh, don't oh. be scared. We're all, are we all cheering them on? Yes. Yay. We're all cheering them on. Canada is cheering you on. Best of luck. The stage is yours. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Now I Dirty dancing. I've been waiting for so long. Yes. Now I finally found someone to stand by Woo! me.
say something you are such an inspiration you really are thank you it's amazing that you do what you do it doesn't matter what your hurdle is and i know there's a lot of young boys who would love to go dirty dancing with their teacher <laughs> <laughs> can, can i can i also say and i, and I want to be really really honest here you didn't look like a dancer to me you know what you looked like a superhero. Oh, yeah. A straight up superhero. Thank you so much. Thank you. Cam, listen, even before you started, you were my personal superhero. So thank you for coming here tonight. Both of you did outstanding, and I really enjoyed it. Why don't you start us off? All right, I am going to start with a big yes, sir. It's a yes from me. Thank you so much. It is a big, big, big yes from me. And four yeses. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I guess that was a good idea. Bye. They're just adorable. <laughs> <laughs>